see uh, now we are uh, uh, looking for uh, how to download data from Scopus, which is you know suitable for Osphere. Okay, so Osphere is a software which is using for uh, you know bibliometric analysis, very beautiful mapping, science mapping, and performance analysis is possible um, through this Osphere. Okay, and let us start uh, with the screen share. Okay. So this is also your screen uh, and just we can, you know, go to Scopus, uh, Scopus, 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 we have, uh, you know, two options, uh, uh, the Scopus uh, old version and the Scopus new version, if you, this is the old version and, and they, they are giving some, you know, uh, nudge to use the new version. But if you try with the new version, if you try with the new version, uh, some features may not be available yet. So they are working with the new version only. It is not completely, it is not completed. So you can return to the old version. So here I have checked this, uh, the documents. Uh, uh, so use some search option. Uh, so I use ESG environment social governance. Uh, so can I can I do it again? Right, right. So I just search for these these are the keywords ESG environment social governance. I want to search this one. So here 1183 some years, I just, I don't want, uh, uh, I want only this years 2000, right? So, you can select the years you want. Right. So just uh, you know, uh, click limit. You want to limit these years and exclude the other one. So click. Okay. So now the documents. Again, this you know one one five seven documents. All right. So these are the documents you total of this is uh, 1157 you want to reduce this computer science decision science mathematics medicine and just click and you know click exclude otherwise you know your data set may be biased so now you have 910 documents 910 documents so now we can just start you know uh, export export so first we can try with the csv mode csv mode then otherwise plain text anyway we can try with the csv first of all here we can find the citation information of those document here etc bibliometric information abstract of those keywords index keywords so these are very essential data we need sponsor funding test uh, conference include references just uh, click the export Scopus, you know, you will get a uh, uh, huge data downloading option. So here ESG old Osphere old version old Scopus. Just you need to identify the data set. Just give a good, I mean, detailed file name. Okay. Then you try with this uh, OSPHERE. So first you click uh, create a map based neural network data. Create a map based on bibliographic data. This is the thing. You just click the next. Read the data from bibliographic data files. Web and scopus. So these are the things. 
clear this one is correct and uh, next and here it is corpus so you just click this corpus and the data set is saved in desktop right so desktop there is belong and data set PST was your old version click ok next yeah now the data set is reading so let us check whether it is ok or not This kind of nine one seven number of uh, the number is high. Yeah. So, so data set, you know, data set is uploaded. If you want to do co currents, uh, you just click the others keyword not all keywords all those keywords okay so just yeah now there is full counting and fractional counting full counting means the full counting of others fractional counting means something like uh, the fraction fractional items are also be there so both concepts are different but now we are looking for the full counting so here uh, the minimum number of occurrence of keywords five is the minimum number five times if the keyword repeated five times we, we, we should select so the five if the keyword repeated five times so that we have uh, 93 uh, keywords 2001 keywords and uh, out of the 2001 keywords 93, 93 keywords meet uh, repeated five times so these keywords are strong in terms they have repeated five times uh, by the others yeah then yes yes so this is the diagram you get it so here you can find green yellow red blue different things you can find the connectivity this is the proximity the connect the close connection which so this is the financial performance financial performance is connected with yeah, we can have different different uh, diagrams. Financial performance is connected with environmental performance, ESG, panel data, COVID-19, green finance, China. If you click the ESG, the end of thing. So this like private equity. Yeah, this one. So everyone relationship you can get. See the link. The, if the link, uh, you know, the distance shows that some uh, distance relationship its proximity the closeness shows that uh, the relatedness of the keyword esg factors and fame value responsible investing okay so some kind of keywords are repeating so that you can you can you can uh, remove that keyword so for that you just go to okay So from here we can remove the repeated one. Here ESG, exponent, social responsibility, governance, financial performance, CSR, corporate governance. Something keyword which is repeated, you just remove it. You don't want SRI. You don't want India. don't want event study so this way you can remove this and finish it this keyword uh, will be removed after that so here you can find a cluster the cluster one cluster one which shows the connection there is a cluster which has been formed automatically by the software Banking industry, board diversity, board size, corporate governance, cost of equity, emerging market. All right. So you can find a story of this cluster. Cluster two also 13 items. 
which of one villain's performance is you can find another story you can find another story regarding this weight is occurrences repeatness of the keyword if you click the link then the diagram will change occurrences it is change All right total length strength it is again change and here analysis also here uh, you know we are using association strength so here also there are different modularity you can just click the update layout so you can have update clustering also you can also rotate the things All right so overlay visualization also you can you know can have different options All right so so this csv file is good uh, for those viewer so this is the thing which is you know collecting data from scopus All right so here uh can have co-authorship analysis authors full counting of fractional counting so next so minimum number of documents of an author just you can give four so of the 2076 authors 28 meet the threshold so only 28 people having four papers otherwise you just reduce it reduce it two okay two papers that may be fine 260 others you selected these are the others uh, so these order has uh, around 15 papers 15 papers and can find lowest papers also can finish it okay so you will get the so others uh, network so this is network based on all those documents the weights are the documents right you give the citation then there's this uh, this, this broad uh, stock and one so these people are having more citations right this is based on the average publication this is a mean scores is average publication this is citation and documents normal citations total link strength and links so the basic thing is the citation wise analysis is good you know which shows the others uh, you know quality of the others because so we are taking the citations okay so basically this is for uh, what we what we did is uh, co-authorship of others if you want to uh, co-authorship of uh, countries you can find uh code minimum countries you need 25 okay so you can give uh four 91 countries 43 meet the threshold right so these are the countries you just finish it here you can find that the united states uh, italy india so you can find the network here Portugal is very distant, having distance, Indonesia, Taiwan, right. So, so this is the overlay visualization. So you can find the yellow color which is uh, 2022 work, Turkey, Lebanon, which is very latest work, and United States, China, right. To give the citation, citation wise again, United States, Germany, and China is there, right? Right. So, uh, so these are the analysis again. You go back to 
uh, the other analysis like uh, you want citation analysis citation of uh, documents okay citation of documents uh, click Minimum number of citation you can just click uh, three, four, five, five citations. So three twenty three meet the threshold. Go to next. Your number of documents three twenty three. Yeah, these are the others. So these other has got eighty three six seventy one citations and he has uh, owning eighty three links. Galbraith 129 citations, you know. So, so this is the diagram we are getting. You can have network, network visualization, right? So this is the citation is the uh, eight. These people are having more. Uh, your analysis you can change to association strength. Okay. So association strength, you can find the, the citations based analysis. Again, if you go back uh, to other analysis. So bibliometric coupling again bibliometric coupling you can work the sources others uh, others so these are the others others which greatest total length strength will be selected uh, for each okay So these others have, uh, you know, they have cross-reference bibliometric coupling. Right. Again, go back. So co-citation. So cited references, cited authors. Right. Uh, for each of the 651 others, the total strength of the co-citation links with the other others will be calculated. The others with the greatest total link strength will be selected, right? So citation-wise analysis, right? So you can find the co-citation, right? So this shows a paper citation, co-citation, right? So this way you can, you know, you can work on with the data set, right? So thank you. Uh, so in brief, uh, we just, you know, download uh, data, uh, the form of CSV file from the Scopus. And so Scopus old version will be good because new version it is working on and it's not completely completed. So there is a problem with the new version and the old version is good. And just download and insert the OSPIA, the CSV files, right? Okay, so thank you.